Thank you. 75 years ago, the United States dropped the atomic bomb over Hiroshima, Japan. Its impact was felt across that country, including the town of a woman who now calls Miraville home. She tells 10 News reporter Shannon Smith why it's a time she will never forget. Oh, Shizuko Braden was 18 when World War II hit its deadliest point in Japan. She grew up in the Osaka region of Japan. She remembers bombs falling from the sky and men shooting from planes. Braden was never hurt. I was lucky. And she lived more than 200 miles away from Hiroshima, but remembers when the atomic bomb dropped. She just like that. Lightning. The lightning she saw far away wasn't lightning. Then next thing I see that the Hiroshima was dropping. Mm -hmm. People they all died. Braden is now almost 94 years old. She moved to the U.S. with her husband, an American soldier in the 50s. Her daughter has to write things down to communicate since she's hard of hearing, but her memories are sharp. It's 75 years then still I can remember. Braden has memorabilia from Japan across her Maryville home. Pictures of her and her late husband. Her daughter says Braden tries not to remember a lot of the scary moments. Don't want to think about it. <laughs> it's something Braden would rather forget, but she's happy to share the stories cemented in her mind. That's like a movie. <laughs> in Maryville, I'm Shannon Smith.